Hello friends, my name is Viren Singh. In this video tutorial, I am going to discuss about microbial growth, microbial kinetics, monad kinetics and yield concepts. Microorganisms are very specific kind of organism which follows a very specific pattern of growth. You can see from here the diagram. There are basically four major phases of microbial growth that is log phase, exponential phase, stationary phase and death phase and two minor phases of microbial growth is decline phase and acceleration phase decline phase is also known as deacceleration phase mu is the net specific growth rate which can defined by this equation mu g minus kd where mu g is the specific growth rate and kd is specific death rate in the lag phase there is no mu g, no growth and no death. That is mu g equal to 0 and k d equal to 0. That's why the net specific growth rate is equal to 0. And you can see from graph here the slope is 0. In the growth phase or in the exponential phase when the cells starts increasing their number by exponentially manner the mu here the k d is less than mu g that's why mu is greater than 0 and it tends to maximum when kd is equal to 0 when kd is equal to 0 then mu tends to maximum in the decline phase or de acceleration phase the growth slows down due to nutrient depletion or due to accumulation of toxic products in the stationary phase here the rate of growth and the rate of death that is specific growth rate constant and specific death rate constant is equal that is mu g equal to k d that's why the mu net specific growth rate is equal to zero in the fourth phase that is death phase here k d is much more greater than the mu g that's why the mu net is less than zero so please remember that mu is near about 0 or equal to 0 in lag phase and stationary phase mu is greater than 0 in growth phase and mu is less than 0 in death phase here the detailed explanation is given for each phases that is lag phases no increase in cell number the period of adaptation to the new environment increase in the mass increase in the cell mass Multiple lag phases can occur when more than one carbon source is present that is known as dioxic growth. When more than one carbon source is present then microorganism utilizes one substrate, one preferential substrate as a carbon source. When the first preferential substrate is exhausted then microorganism utilizes the second substrate that is microorganism utilizes substrate in preferential manner then this growth is known as dioxic growth i will tell you the detailed explanation of dioxic growth later the length of lag phase depends upon the three factors mainly characteristics of microbial species inoculum size and inoculum age inoculum size and inoculum age have very huge effect on lag phase you can minimize the length of lag phase by varying the inoculum size in the log phase you can see increase in the cell mass as well as in cell number exponentially the the phase is a straight line obviously this is straight line why because it increases exponentially this is the period of balanced growth composition of biomass remains constant because each and every component of biomass each and every component of cell is increasing simultaneously that's why the composition of biomass remains constant the exponential growth follow the first order reaction here the growth rate that is mu g is greater than the death rate that is kd in stationary phase net growth rate is zero because growth rate is equal to death rate here the gro net specific growth rate is zero but cells are metabolically active and produces secondary metabolites why the stationary phase occurs because exhaustion of essential nutrients accumulation of toxic products what is cryptic growth when 
cell utilizes the dead cells as a substrate and grows upon the dead cell that is known as cryptic growth. In death phase, the growth rate is less than death rate. Similarly, the reason is exhaustion of essential nutrient, accumulation of toxic products and the death kinetics also follow the first order. Please do like and subscribe my channel for more updates. Thank you.